Hey everybody, it's the boss lady here coming to you from my, well, not my vehicle. Well, yeah, husband's vehicle. Um, today is November 13th, so it's the day after my birthday. And um, you gotta forgive me because I am tired. Um, it's one of our Sunday Sunday outings or whatever. Um, let's see, turn this temp down because I'm hot. So we normally go to what we, we call it the convention, like, it's kind of like a toy convention, but it's a lot of men, older men, um, who have collectible cars and things. And so they, you know, my husband comes and he looks and whatever. So, uh, he and I started first and then now recently we started bringing Miss Pina. So him and Miss Pina are inside. I don't like going inside, especially after COVID hit. So yeah, um, so I stay in the car, but anyway, <clears throat> How y'all doing? It's a weird angle, so I'm sorry about that. But this is the best I could do. You know, it's not my vehicle. Um, How was my birthday? I was going to do a vlog of, like, you know, you guys going out with me on my birthday. That did not happen. Um, <laughs> I think I had a little bit of clip, which I'll probably insert here. Yes, yeah, so let me insert that here. Hey everybody, it's the boss lady here coming to you from my vehicle. Um, today is my birthday, November the 12th, and I am trying to uh, use my little birthday coupons and stuff. So I'm out and about by myself, away from the family, just, you know, I need to have a moment. How about that? So I just pulled up to Michael's. I'm going to take you inside and show you what I plan to get. Stay tuned. So y'all know I love me some Christmas. Um, I haven't showed you guys this, I don't think, but I'm going to grab me one more. I already picked this up, um, but I'm getting one more of these. Um, if I get anything else out of here, I will show you at a later time. Okay, so I was going to take you guys like on several little trips with me. Only got to go to Michael's. Um, my day wasn't going as I had hoped, as I had planned. So, I will say this, just to, you know, put it out there. Excuse me. Never expect anyone to do anything for you. Do it yourself. So, I will say this. I am very happy and grateful that I did make plans for my birthday. Um... You know, Miss Pena and I, we went to go see Wakanda Forever. Excuse me. So I did post a picture on the community page. I'll post it here of what I had on. So I had on an all-white outfit, white boots. And let me tell you, to get those pictures was brutal. It was freezing outside. It was like 30-some degrees. Like, I mean, literally cold, cold. And Miss Pena was like, Mom, are you sure? And I'm like, yes. Yeah. There was one picture she took. She was so cold, her hands were trembling. So when I saw the picture, the picture was blurry because she was moving so much. But anyway, so I posted what I could to show you guys what I had on. <clears throat> Love the outfit, hands down. I did not wear a body slimmer, which I'm okay with. Y'all, after those pictures were taken, Miss P and I went to dinner. I literally kept my coat on. And yes, oh, before, because you guys... I, it's cold. It's 26 degrees. I have my coat right here. I took it off because I'm sitting in the car and the heat's blowing on me. But anyway, so <laughs> I went to dinner. We went to Applebee's, Miss Pina and I. And I don't care. Hands down, I got to have my buffalo wings. Y'all, I had my coat zipped up. How I got dirty, I do not know. Okay. But yes, I had dripped buffalo sauce right at the collar part, right? So I get to my mom's, and I didn't even know it was on my coat. It was, yeah. I get to my mom's, and my mom's like, oh my God, your shirt. I'm like, what? And so my mom sprung into action, y'all. She got some, I don't know what kind of wet wipes that she used, but she got these wet wipes out. She was like, come in here, get in the kitchen, blah, blah, blah. So she got these wet wipes out. She started cleaning, cleaning, cleaning real quick. Then she got some um, cold water and Dawn dish soap. And my mom blotted and scrubbed a little. And when I tell you that woman got that stain out, because I was so upset. 
I was like, I'm throwing a whole outfit away. Not realizing how much I had paid for the outfit. I paid like, <laughs> yeah, I paid some money for the outfit. I said, I'm throwing it away. As soon as I get home, I'm throwing it away. As nobody's going to see me, I'm going to be in the dark, blah, blah, blah. Child, mama got that stain completely out. Like, you could not tell that it was orange red sauce on me. I mean, yeah. So, mom got it out. Uh, we sat over at mom and dad's for about mm, 30, 45 minutes. And then we went to um, the movies. I'm not going to tell the movie because I know there's people who probably still want to see it. I will just say that, one, I am glad that I wore white. Um, <laughs> and I don't, I don't want to get emotional. Chadwick Boseman, the actor, in the original first Black Panther, um, he was one of my favorite actors. And I don't get too hung up to attach i mean there's only a few people who have you know succumbed to death and i've gotten emotional about so like whitney houston um the guy from the fast and the furious i can't remember his name but um you know the white guy he was uh in a car crash but chadwick boseman to me he he was he still is the black panther right so to see the movie and how just how they they brought part you know the black panther some of the clips and put it into wakanda forever i mean the emotions were high like before i left my mom i said mom i need tissue i said i've been hearing a lot of people say you know make sure you bring your tissue i said i want to bring my tissue because to me i felt like i was going to his funeral or his memorial, right? And so it was very, very, very emotional for me. Um, and there was other scenes in there that was emotional too, but yeah, so I did cry. I mean, like I had that ugly cry, okay? Like, you know, your grandmama done died cry because Lord have mercy did I cry for my grandmother. So anyway, um, it was a great movie. Miss P and I, we enjoyed it. Um, I have, I went to McDonald's and McDonald's is selling the Wakanda Forever um, little toys for the Happy Meals. So I got two of them and I have them up in my office. So I insert that picture here. So you'll see my, my original Black Panther um, uh, picture that I got from Hobby Lobby. And then I got the two little um, characters from the second movie. And then um, it also has a birthday card in there from my boss. So yeah, so that was, I mean... I have been planning Friday night's event since July, since I was in Iowa. And so, um, you know, and I wore my Black Panther t-shirt during the day. So I insert that picture here. I did wear that because I was like, oh my gosh, I got my Black Panther shirt, but now I'm going to be wearing white. So I'm gonna, going to wear my shirt. And because it was Friday, it was casual day at work. So I wore my Black Panther shirt to work and yeah everybody was walking up Wakanda forever I mean for real it was just amazing so Miss Pina had on her shirt I only got one picture of her so I'll show that here this is when we were at dinner and yes she still had her mask on but um so you guys could see like our shirts were different like mine was the black hers was the purple hands down amazing um like I said Saturday my original birthday um my exact birthday the 12th it did not go as I had hoped, as I had planned. Um, but I will say this. I was not harmed. I was not hurt, physically hurt. Um, I received a lot of love. So even though what my mind was saying how my birthday should go, it, did, it didn't go that way, but it still was a blessed day. Um, I received phone calls, text messages, um, messages on YouTube, messages on Facebook, messages on Instagram. Um, you know, it was just amazing that, you know, people just took time out their schedule, just a couple, two, three seconds to say happy birthday. You know, so I appreciate all the love that was given. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, my husband is not really big on celebrations. So, you know, to pull things out of him is a lot. Um, but I did get a gift. He had brought it up. Well, you know, um, him and Miss Peanut 
a couple about what two weeks ago they both bought me a funko pop so one was of the queen from wakanda forever the other one was whitney houston because i mean yes whitney is my favorite uh singer so i think i have a picture of that so i'll insert that here now what i did not take a picture of is my actual gift on my birthday um i got it late in the afternoon um but he bought me a new tablet uh, my husband is big on electronics y'all so when it comes to computers laptops tablets cell phones airpods um the watches all of that even though i don't have my smart watch on i just got a regular watch he's all about the tech stuff so um i have everything else and the one thing that he wanted me to have was a new tablet so he did give me a new tablet i have yet to like physically set it up i mean he did put the internet and stuff on there so but with the tablet he got me now to samsung i can mirror my phone to the tablet and i actually can take calls off the tablet i can text off the tablet all that stuff so because i was in a mood i was i was being a brat yeah mm -hmm. i'll be a brat on my day because i woke up saying i'm off the clock and you know what don't be afraid to do that sometimes sometimes you know when it seems like you're doing 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 for family friends and whoever um sometimes you have to just say you know what today is my day and i'm not going to do anything else so i'm not going to be i mean i'm always going to be a mom because i you know i birthed my kids you know yes i'm a wife but i'm not gonna do my wifely duties as far as oh wife can you you know check this out for me can you type this up for me can you grab this for me no i'm not doing that so i said i'm off the clock you know i'm not working today neither job i'm not doing no laundry i'm not doing no cleaning i'm not right so he was like okay <laughs> i'm not cooking so he did get dinner for me so that was nice um the one thing that i did not get that i was a little bummed about is my cake and i am going to mention that to him today is you know i didn't get my cake i didn't get my cupcake or something you know i didn't get something to, you know saying happy birthday now they did attempt to sing happy birthday but at the time of them attempting i was a little bratish and said i don't need no music don't sing to me because and the reason why I say it like that is because they, you know, Miss Peanut and him, they were both just waking up. And they're human, but they were just like humdrum, you know. And I'm like, wait a minute now, it's a holiday. You're supposed to be excited. But I was the one who carried the excitement. So we went and got coffee. They got breakfast. I dropped them off, and then I went about my day. So that's when I went to Michael's. I also went to Lane Bryant. I'm glad I did not record when i was at lane bryant because it was not a great experience for me um the lane bryant experience was horrible i am a a lane rewards member so i get all the well i sign up for everything anything rewards related i sign up for so i've been getting all kind of emails you know use it between now and next month or the end of the month excuse me and um so I had a coupon for Lane Bryant, spend $20, get $20 off. So basically you get some for free. Um, normally around this time of year, I always stock up on like, you know, my unmentionables, you know, my bras and panties. And so I didn't need bras so just yet, but I wanted to get panties. And um, they had a sale. The sale wasn't as great. I like the, the, um, the sale when it's like 10 pairs of panties for like 35, but it was six pair of panties for 35. That's okay. I'm okay with that because why? I still had a coupon. Well, the, the cashier, she acted as if my coupon would not be used or could not be used. Oh, I don't know if that's going to work. And so then, you know how they have the, um, the little scanner so she was like well you're gonna need to hold your phone up to it so as i'm holding my phone to the scanner right this is the scanner and this is my phone i'm holding my phone she's doing like this you know i'm holding the phone still she's doing like this with the scanner and trying and oh well it doesn't seem like it's going through i'm not new to this <laughs> and i am the boss lady and you know she was an older woman you know but she tried to make it seem like 
the coupon wasn't going to work. And I'm like, lady, I do this every year and have been at least for the last 10 years. Don't play with me. So finally, she kept doing like this. And so finally, I just started doing it with her, right? You know, so as she moved, I moved just like that. And so as soon as it synced up, clip, it, you know, it, it beeped and stuff. So then she was like, oh, oh, oh. My original total came up to sixty-four fifty. With the sale, it brought it down to thirty-five dollars. With my coupon, I ended up paying fourteen ninety-eight. And she was just like, "Oh, because it well, it came up to was it? It should have been thirty-five, but it came up to thirty-four ninety-eight. That's what it came up to. So it went from six sixty-four fifty to thirty-four ninety-eight. With my coupon, it brought it down to fourteen ninety eight. Because it was like, I think you had to like spend, I don't know, additional pennies or something. I don't remember. But anyways, I paid fourteen ninety eight for my purchase. And I was so irritated with her. And I was on the phone. And I was, I told, you know, my daughter, I said, let me call you back. Because I, you know, I wanted to, you know, deal with the lady. But, and she was like, oh, you have a good day. I said, oh, I already am. Even though you try to ruin it. You know what I mean? So I was like, whatever. And then I just said, let me get out of here. I did go to Old Navy. Old Navy was a bust. I had um, I had a coupon for Old Navy, but it was a bust. So I said, whatever, you know. Um, and I have coupons for a few other places. I think Macy's and Kohl's and um, Macy's, Kohl's. I even got some for CVS and somewhere else. I can't remember. But yeah, so, you know, throughout the, the rest of this week, I'll probably pop in a couple stores or whatever and grab some things. It probably won't be for me. It'll probably be more so um, for like Miss Peanut for Christmas and things like that. Because typically every year I take my birthday coupons outside of Lane Bryant. I take my birthday coupons and I use my coupons for Christmas gifts. And that's how I get more money off. Like, you know, there's already a sale and then I have my coupons, which gives me more sales. You know what I mean? So anyway. Um, so yes, I had some time to myself, and then when I went home, I just, as they say, Netflix and chilled, but I think I wasn't on Netflix, I was on Discovery Plus, but anyway, and I just kind of just chilled the rest of the day, and I didn't get up to do nothing, you know, um, every now and then I would take a little nap, you know, and it felt good just to rest, because I hadn't been resting, and with all the illness and sickness that's going around at my jobs, both jobs, I'm like, I really need time to rest. So I was glad to be able to do that. Sorry. Something in my eye. But um, like I said, Bossman and Miss Peanut, you know, got me gifts. And, um, you know, he did dinner last night. So we had chicken, mashed potatoes and gravy, macaroni and cheese, and dinner rolls. I was fine with that, too. So, today is Sunday. Today is basically clean day. Um, I want to start getting my stuff outside. Uh, it is cold, so the ground is starting to harden. But, yeah, that was it in a nutshell. So, we'll probably go over to um, where we are. We're about 20 minutes from home, 25 minutes from home. Where we are, there is a Target next door and a Walmart a little further down and I know all these is across the street so we're probably gonna stop at the store because I think he wanted to get some vegetables and stuff and I want to grab some fruit but that's about it that's my birthday in a nutshell guys so I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see everybody in a new video bye guys